Hello everybody, my name is Miguel, welcome back to The Last Door, Chapter 3. So, this is going to be the first of The Last Door games where it's going to be in multiple parts because I don't know how long this will be. So hopefully this ends up being like the finale part of this game or maybe there's a lot more to go, so I don't know. So I got me a container, so what I need to do now is head back to get the water, which is in here. Or not the water, but the grimy, the gr the grimy shit. And then go back to that filtering machine. Collect some water. Oh, I need to click on it. I collected some of the oily water in my gin bottle. So I got that now. Because with the oil, I can use the lamp for it. So I, yeah, I can skip through now. And I also needed to get into that dark room in any other dark place. That sewer area too. So this is where I need to go. So I can skip through. And I hope I could, oh, really wish I could skip through the walking though. So I gotta go inside here, and it just goes here. So I need to go over here and use this thing. It's a glass essence here. I need to. There we go. I pour the contents of the bottle into the essence here, and the oil floats on the surface. When I open the valve, I will drain the water until all the water has have has been removed. That's it. I've extracted all the water. Now, only the oil now remains. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Okay. So I can fill it. I fill the lamp with oil. I hope it will be enough to last the night. It should. I guess. It. I guess that shows right there how much oil I've got. Just that little much. Or I guess that's not even. I don't know. I've got oil now to go into the dark areas now. So. Let's go take care of that. So all is quiet here in this area, but then when I go out to the city and the music starts playing, just the violins and basses and violas and whatever other instruments they're called. Uh, let's check here first since I'm already here. I can use the lantern on the dark air. Well, I think I can just walk through. It's very dark. I don't dare go in. How do I... Ah, I gotta go use the amber. I gotta go grab one of those uh, ambers, I bet. Which, to light it up. Because I, I need, I need some, sort of, some sort of... Some way through the... Though the embers look as though those soon as it's been... There we go. There we go. Now we got a, a lint lamp. A lint lamp? Who are you calling a cootie queen, you lint licker? That's an Orbit commercial right there. Orbit's good. Alright, well, since I'm already here, let's just go here first. So I, I, don't, I don't even know what hill is in here. Okay, dude. I hear a woman's voice in the distance. I hear it too. No, don't, don't, don't. Do not fall asleep. Do not fall asleep. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is creepy. This is creepy. I do not like it. I, I don't like it. Yeah. It's creepy as hell. Oh. Something on the ground. There's a note partly obscured by mud. I mustn't fall asleep. I hear them crawling. I hear them gnawing. Rats. Too many of them. They know I'm here. I mustn't fall asleep. They stalk me. Coming closer and closer. I can see their blood red eyes glimmering in the darkness. I mustn't fall asleep. Something else here, too. A pile of ragged clothes caked with mud and full of holes. Anyway. I don't hear the singing anymore. I, I don't hear the singing anymore. Oh, there goes the singing. The dead roots of a once great tree feel the cavernous sewer. A strange green moss covers its surface and there is a great crack along its length. So I might need something to get through there I'm guessing. So not much I can do here. Not for right now. At, at least at least I think so. So I just need to just click my way through back here and head into the other room because it might have something there. No, no, don't, don't read that. Don't read that. 
You already read that already. Just keep going. There we go. There we go. So we just skip through. And then this is where we need to go into. Oh yeah, the, fo the foggy area too. Alright, so let's see what we got here. An old worn out coat hangs on the rack. It, in one of its pockets is a pair of gloves. Oh goody. I wonder what I'm gonna need the gloves for. A picture has collapsed from the wall. Can we uh, check what it is? No, we can't. There's an upstairs area. This portrait of a gentleman with a distant look seems vaguely familiar. You think? Let's check here. An old bottle of St. Emilion Grand Cru is covered with dust. Can I take it? There's a door here. Maybe I can, take, maybe I can check through the door. Oh. What do we got here? Mold covers the wood stacked in this shed. There's a tree stump. Judging by the resin oozing on the surface of this tree trunk, it appears to have been recently chopped down. And then there's uh, this area. This door is locked. I can't even move it. Oh boy. The walls of the mausoleum are crumbled with age. Oh man. There's a lot of areas that I can go into. So far, I've seemed to be doing okay with the puzzle solving. I got lucky with that oh, one in the that little butcher area. So I gotta go in here, up here. Oh, darkness, more darkness, great. Bright meadow. Picture has faded to a dull color. I heard that, I heard that, I heard that, I heard that. You got... Now my eyes focus in the gloom. I can see that the person sitting on the bed is an el elderly woman. She's just dressed up as a young girl for some reason. She appears not to hear or see me from here. I will need to get closer if I am to explain myself. Uh, my reflection stares back at me through the grime. An old wardrobe. There's something amongst the embers. Well, I already got a lint lamp, so... March 8th, 1843. I'm exhausted. Father made me rehearse today for eight hours. Jesus. By the end, the music wavered with his trembling hands. It's still a long time for the day of the show, but he insisted that everything must be perfect. One more song, he said over and over. Jeez. March 21st, 1843. Father got really mad at me, and he started to shout when many after many hours of rehearsal, I said that I wanted to get out and play a little bit in the street. Well, you're a child, so... I mean, a child should be able to live their childhood as much as they, as much as they can. More and more, he's obsessed with rehearsing, with concerts, with perfection. April third, eighteen forty-three. Am I not the one who earns the money to feed us? Am I not the one? Am I not the one people? Come, oh, am I not the one people come from all over to see and admire? Is my name not the one printed on all the posters? My name. The dolls for sale at the theater entrance. They have my likeness, my dress, and my beautiful hair. I should be the one who makes this makes the decisions. April 21st, 1843. One more song. Yes, one more. A last song for you, Papa. Okay. No, I don't want to dance and sing anymore. It's enough for today. I want my lemonade. I want to play. Uh, who? Actually, madame, I'm afraid I've never met you before. I don't know who you are. Ah, don't you recognize me? Uh, no, I don't. No, madam, I'm afraid I do not. I'm very sorry. Oh, no, no, not at all. It's fine. It's been a while since I last performed, I suppose, but you don't forget it. But don't you forget it. I am the great little caddy, singer, dancer, the golden girl of London's music halls. Uh, weird man. I have to go. I want to get out of this place. Weird man. Oh, the guy that was staring at me. Do, does she know about him? I'm looking for a gentleman. He's wear, well dressed with red hair. Do you know him? He led me to this place. No, father. I have been. I just told you I'm not your dad. I have been practicing the latest repertoire as you ordered. I have behaved very well today, haven't I? Um, I want to get out of this place. Hide and seek. Oh, I do love games. I, 
I go to the fog when I want to get away. Daddy won't find me there. You see, in the fog, there are no faces. Let's play. Oh, no, I don't want to play. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Now, stand next to the fireplace and count to three. Oh, for fuck's sake, I probably should have gone out when I had the chance. One, two, three. What's the time, Mr. Wolf? Uh... Oh, one, two, three. What's the time, Mr. Wolf? Oh! One, two, three. What's the time, Mr. Wolf? Okay. So she's getting younger. One, two, three. What's the time, Mr. Wolf? Oh, okay. I wanna get out. What the blazes just happened? My head, it's pounding, and where did she go? Uh, to hide, I presume. The pile of things on the floor after Caddy's disappearance. There's a mask. I take the mask. Hey, Jesus, that scared me. It's a cracked mask. It's a porcelain mask. Oh. It broke when it filled. The distorted features, there's a grotesque grotesqueness to them. I don't like to look at it. I'm sure you don't. And look underneath the mask photograph. Little Caddy and her father. It has a note, Little Caddy Show. There's a girl lit up by a spotlight. Excuse me. In the music hall. I gotta try not to, like, have food before I record because it's just gonna make me all belchy. In the music hall, singing to live piano. Great. Let's just, um... Let's just go before it. Let's just, let's just keep going through. There's a ladder. Maybe I should go check the end of the hallway first for... Okay, the laughing I hear is coming from here. Wait, this house, this room, this hallway looks familiar. Let's just... The doorknob is missing. No shit. Let's go in here. Oh, great. Okay. Oh, jeez. A painting of a beautiful young lady with the, with a peaceful expression. She looks like one of Raphael's angels. Second violin, bar two. That's what she's... So I hope, she, I hope you don't mind me just walking exploring your shit while you're practicing your violin. Notes, F-E-D, pulled c consistently. Paper bound, paper bound up in a roll. It seems to have to be a discarded musical score. Constantly. Ah, there we go. Oh, that was consistent. The tailor's mannequin. Why is it beside the window? To give people the illusion that it's probably a, a, a hideous being saying the wallpaper is torn. Well, let's talk to this bastard. No, no, no. Did I not pray enough? Have I not written faithfully every last note you screwed into me? Middle C up to A. Measure. G up to C. Tied. F. Second violin, bar two, middle C up to A, double note, E, G, C. No, this is supposed to be our masterpiece, viola, C, up an octave, and then up to G. What? What? Who do you think you are? Are you blind, man? Can't you see that I am creating the angel's voice? The work? C to A, an octave higher, a fragile voice flutters around the strophe. No, 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 no. No, no. Hands swallow you, laugh at you. I lost it again. Are you all right, sir? Cool, bro. I mean, uh, you seem to be acting a little uh, mad at yourself. Uh, my inspiration, too, is lost. Quite lost. In the fog. The notes moan. Just her. Uh, uh, who's moaning her? Probably, probably moaning from something else. I'm just kidding. I, I'm sorry. That was that was that was a fucked up joke. I, that, too, that was that was not the right time to do that. Who was she? Oh, beautiful Daphne. Oh, the best soloist that a composer could have. The voice of an angel. What made my music possible? She would stand there by the window. The oh, that explains the mannequin. The wind caressed her cheeks. It danced in her golden hair. Her dress, her dress, my voice cracked a little bit. The dre her dress glowed like an ember in the dark s dusk sun. What happened to her? 
When I'm to her, she was very delicate, like a flower in the desert, like a petal in the storm. The sickness, it just swept her away. Her voice, my God, her voice. No, oh, my, my, her voice, my God, her voice. It came from heaven. She was the angel of my music. Oh, the mausoleum. The mausoleum outside the house. Is that where Daphne is? Buried? That's right. I have visited her many nights and have even slept beside her on the cold, wet stone floor. Jesus, fuck, dude. Okay, I am following a man. So, come to think of it, maybe he is following me. He has a red beard and wears a cape. I sometimes find this man, too, among my notes. I feel him close to me at times. Uh, Jeff, please, please, I need to get out of this place. You ask me for words, but words are betrayers. They're dirty. Music just, music remains beautiful, but it's a prisoner inside all of us. We must set it free. I can't help you now. Not until my work is finished. My work is the important thing. She was my only inspiration. I must go. Let music and singing surround you, my man. Well, at least he's much more sane than that crazy bitch that wanted to play hide and seek. I think she's. I think she thinks we're. Play oh yeah, the ladder. This cage must have housed a huge bird. Only a feather remains. Take the feather. Can't reach the feather from here. Uh huh. Well, let's check over here then. It looks like the lyrics to a song entitled "The Last Song for You." The verses are scrawled so poorly as to make them it, 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 illegible. This piano is so dusty. I dare say it hasn't been played in years. I wonder if it still works. He's playing. Something is preventing one of the keys from depressing. There's a key hidden under the key. Th there was a key hidden under the key. Key as in like the one of those piano thingies. There's a key to open a door under the piano keys. That so that way that way you guys don't get confused. Oh, I found I got the key already. Okay, so so we got a key that doesn't have a doorknob. That door doesn't have a doorknob, so there's no reason to go through there yet. It's missing a doorknob, so let's go through here. Let's go back. Let's go the fuck back. So, maybe the keys for the mausoleum, I'm guessing. I don't want to go into the I don't want to go out to the foggy area yet. Keyhole's too big for such a small key, okay, so it's not the, it's not the one. So it belongs to another door, which I don't know what door. I don't know what door would it be for. The gate, maybe the gate. Could be for the gate, maybe. We're gonna, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to check. Maybe possibly for this one. Gate is latched shut. I can't open it from this side. Let's just give it a go. Nope, doesn't work. Okay, well, it was worth a shot. Let's just uh, storm through around real quick. Just making sure I don't miss anything. Uh, that was not. There's nothing else there in that butcher area. In that carniceria. So the only way, the only other option is the fog area. So that's where we can only go. But. Fog is so freaking thick. I can't go that way. Okay, so I gotta keep going this way. Yeah, this is where we can go, and that crazy girl, for all we know, is po probably there. Oh god, this is so scary. This is so scary. Whoa, 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 whoa. I clicked on I got lost in the fog. If I'm to make my way through, I will need to orient myself somehow. How did I... Really? Did I really get, honestly get lost? Okay, so I gotta keep going. I gotta click up the floor. So... So there's the first tree. Keep walking. So, that was the first area. 
I just gotta keep going. No, I'm just gonna keep going through the keep clicking on the floor. Keep clicking on the floor. So right here. Fuck! Are you serious? I got lost in the fog. If I'm to wake through, I need I, I will need to orient myself somehow. So how does one do this? So I might have to pick a sweet, like a sweet spot to get through the fog. So maybe that's what's need to be done. That sound is not a good sound. Because that's in the fog. Okay, I clicked on that already. So maybe somewhere here I gotta click on. I already went all the way to the back. So it's gotta be somewhere here. Okay, um... Jesus, what the hell? I don't know what I should be doing with that. Got a key, gloves. No, it doesn't mix. Ticket somewhere. Broken porcelain mask. Oh. Okay, okay. That's what the magnifying glass was for. So maybe there's something here that I have to check. Uh, it said piece of furniture. So there's something here that I might have to open up. Like here, 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 here. Here, here, here. Oh, no, no, not that, not that, not that. Not there. Okay, this key before. Maybe from... Oh, I don't remember. This is back here, so that's... This key could be for something here. Shit, I don't even remember. I don't want to fucking be back in this room. Or, ah! There we go. There is an elegant scarlet party dress inside. What the hell would I need that for? Uh... Wait, what? Really? That's a, that's a note. Yeah, yeah, that's, those, those are notes. I, I read those already. Jesus, that girl showed it. That lady just popped up out of nowhere after reading those notes. So I got a dress, but... I got a dress, but what the hell? So that's all. So there's that guy cackling. I guess I've made some decent progress, I'm not really sure. I mean, it's just fucking... So I, I need to take my drink. <sighs> some nice iced tea right there. Actually, it's not iced tea. It was iced tea, it was iced tea but it was a... Uh, it's now Mountain Dew Code Raid. Not, uh, not, not a lot of people are fans of, like, <clears throat> soda like that. We're not just in soda in general, just just because it's like... It was high, it's high in, it's high in sugar and it's not good for you, it's not healthy. So I can't go that way, so... I need to keep going this way. Skip it another go. So I have to pick the right area to click on, I, I guess. I got all this sh hold on. A scarlet party dress. Of course, gloves. Scuffed and stained. Four, I wonder how it got in my pocket. The four witnesses. A ticket to see a play called The Four Witnesses. So, the, no, no, no. Here it takes me back. It will take me back. Yeah. I got lost in the fog. If I'm going to make it through, I need to orient myself. That's what I'm trying to do, but. I'm trying to remember, was there something I need in order to get rid of this fog, because I don't remember. I'm trying to remember some shit. That's gonna take me back. Yeah, it took me back. Holy crap. Well, 
let's just skim through everywhere real quick just to make sure I didn't miss anything let's see wait let's see if this uh, a weird man Out. There's no way to exit the fog. We can only wander around and get lost in it. In the fog, all the stars die. I'm following a man. He must have passed this way. And how is that man? Tall, well dressed, red hair, and cold look in his eye. The nightmare which we don't talk about. All of us, sleep or awake, we have seen that man sometime. Pardon me, I must go. I have to guide my footsteps. I don't know what you mean by that. I'm trying to find my way out of here, but I don't know. Don't know where to go. Have I gone down here? No, I haven't. I see factories on the horizon. They look abandoned. There has to be some sort of. You may keep miserable. Can I make games right? I do not know what to do. Alright, well. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna cut it here and then we'll give it another go so this is gonna be three parts of this episode uh, of this yeah of this of this video or, or this game so I don't know how much longer it is to this game it's only going long because I'm trying to figure out the what else to do next so I hope you guys enjoyed this one I know I may not have made that much progress maybe I, I don't remember but I'm gonna record another one after this one so you know, looking for that. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Help me out a lot. I really, really appreciate it. Until next time, see you guys next video. Bye, everyone. Well, I still have six customers. Oh, oh. I'm going to have to fuck this up. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Okay, okay. Wait, what? Where are you? Where are you at? Oh. Are you still following him? No, I killed someone, but I, I spotted someone else now. Where? Where is he at? You are no no no. What? Where am I? I just I just wanted to I just wanted to sell you something. Yeah, how about you?